I think everybody is looking at carbon footprint. You know, today the environment is a big thing. So we, uh, we currently have uh, uh, the system picks up more units per day than we ever did. And I, I'm going to give you some approximate numbers, and if I'm off, somebody's going to tell me. We used to pick up approximately 500 homes a day, and now we're up over 800 homes a day. So what does that mean? Doing more, getting the job accomplished quicker, trucks off the streets quicker, that all, I think at the end of the day, gives you a better environmental air quality. It, it, it does all the things that you're wanting to do, and those are the subtle things that people don't think about. We automated our recycling program and we went to a single stream program where it made it a lot easier for residents to recycle a lot more materials, cardboards, other things, instead of having a 30 gallon square container, now they have a 64 gallon cart that a lot of them load up every week. So we're more eco-friendly through the fact that we're recycling quite a bit more, probably about 20% more. Single stream recycling is, um, everything's commingled. Uh, you don't have to, when we take our materials, they're not, um, sorted out. Some cities they're called dual stream, they're separating their fiber, paper, and then all your other commodities like the plastics, um, metal, so forth, those are in another stream. Well this is all mixed together and what happens is it goes to a recycling morph, is dumped on a tip floor. Uh, as far as ours goes, ours is transferred now to a facility in um, North Canton and then it's separated through mechanical devices and hand sorting at that point and what it does single stream recycling makes it a lot easier for residents to recycle. We've got a director now into the schools pushing recycling. Our recycling is up over 20 to 25 percent compared to what it was a year ago before automation. More and more people today are using recycling so um, you know our land tipping fees are down because more people are using recycling and it, overall our recycling program has definitely benefited and right now we're actually looking at possibly building a new building to handle our increase in recycling. So, you know, it's kind of a negative impact that we got to expand our, our, our facility, but at the same time, it's a very positive for the environment too. You know, we're using a lot less gas. We have more efficient equipment now. Um, the trucks are getting better gas mileage than our old trucks were. So right there alone, we're saving on gas. You've got two trucks as opposed to three. So that, I mean, it doesn't sound like a lot, but you know, a 50 gallon truck, once you fill it up every day, um, you know, 50 gallons here, 50 gallons there. Small pennies add up to big dollars in the long run. And, you know, you, you can't say enough of where you can save money. And, and gas continuously is going up. So whenever you can save money on your carbon footprint, you got to do it too.